So for today's video, I thought I would show you guys my palette collection, my eyeshadow palette collection. And I don't really have a lot. I'll show you guys the overall. But this is all my eyeshadow palettes. These are the smaller ones, and these are the bigger ones. I'm going to start off with the smaller ones. But this is convenient enough for me. I don't feel like I'm going to use all of this in my whole entire life. I feel like I'm going to get like more palettes and stuff. This is just the beginning, but I feel like I've acquired enough to do a collection for you guys. I don't think I've ever done video on all my palettes maybe I have a while ago I don't even remember <laughs> but one palette that I can't find is my Too Faced chocolate palette I don't know where that is right now but once I find it I'm gonna use it because I miss it and I'm probably gonna look around tomorrow and try to find it because it has to be somewhere in this room but besides that let's just get started so the first palette this is a newer palette that I have bought this is the burgundy times nine eyeshadow palette from MAC. Can we take a minute for these beautiful burgundy shades? I'm in love. I love the color burgundy. I'm actually wearing this on my eyes right now. I'm wearing this one on my lid and then these two mixed in my crease. So I'm gonna swatch my two favorites. These are actually my two favorites. I use this one on the lid and then I'll put this in the crease. It looks so pretty. So I'm gonna swatch that for you guys. Like look at the pigmentation. MAC never fails to disappoint me. Er, wait. Yeah, MAC never fails to disappoint me. Does that make sense? I think so. <laughs> but they're so, so creamy and then there's still like some left over on my hands. I had a makeup remover wipe. Oh, here it is. Let's see, remove this. But it is such a beautiful palette. Next, this is the Urban Decay. I don't know the name of this eyeshadow palette. If I find it, I can link them down below for you guys. I don't remember the name of this palette though, it doesn't say. But these are the shadows. It comes with 10 glittery shades. I used all of one of them though. Sin, this is how I got obsessed with Sin and then I started buying the single ones. Actually my cousin started getting them for me for Christmas. This is actually the shade that was in there. But I used to actually wear this eyeshadow palette all the time. I used to use the purples and then I used to use Sin and Chopper which is that one. I never actually used the green or smog or the blue one, but I used all the other ones. I used um, Polyester Bride and Grifter. Used to be my favorite for purple eyeshadow looks because I used to love to do purple eyeshadow looks. And I should probably get back to that because I actually really loved the way that looked. And maybe I can make it look even better now. The next palette, this is the Too Faced Naked Eye Palette. I feel like this is one of the first eyeshadow palettes I've ever owned. My cousin actually gave this one to me. But this is what it looks like. My favorites were the white one and that pink one. Um, this brown one is an amazing color. And then the black one I used to use underneath my eyes. And then I have two drugstore palettes. I'm surprised that these are the only drugstore eyeshadow palettes that I own. I'm very shocked about that. But this one is the Nudes from Maybelline. I really don't like this palette as much as I'd like this one. But this is what they look like. I have used this shade before and then these two. But besides that, I haven't touched this palette since Christmas. Or like the week after when I first tried it. I didn't really like it that much so I didn't use it. And then this one I used for two months I think after Christmas. And then I got all these other ones. So I kind of straight from this one but I actually want to use this look um this one for a look tomorrow so I'm gonna keep it out but this is what the palette looks like those two are my favorites I'll swatch them for you that's what they look like and they're very pigmented for Maybelline I was very impressed with that one but when I tried out the other one because I tried out the the pink one first the blush nudes so I was like oh my god I'm probably gonna like the other one and I don't like the other one I was very disappointed so now we're getting into our bigger palettes. The first one, this is the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. And this is what it looks like. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm obsessed with this. I used this yesterday for my eyeshadow look. I think I used these two. I used these. I'm obsessed with these two. I actually want to do a look with these in the future. Like more looks with them. I want to try out this one right here. They're all just so beautiful. 
I smell like peaches. I love peaches so much and the smell is just amazing. I got some on my hand. <laughs> Next, this is the Modern Renaissance palette. I think this is my most used eyeshadow palette ever. I'm obsessed. One of my favorites. This is what it looks like. I did a whole video on this palette on my other channel. If you guys want to check that out, because I don't really want to go too far in depth with it if you're an old subscriber and you're like, we heard you talk about this a million times. It's amazing. I recommend. If I had to recommend one palette from this video, this would be one of them, and then the next one I'm going to show you would be the other one I recommend to you. This is the Huda Beauty Rose Gold Edition eyeshadow palette. I have never seen such more beautiful shades in this palette in my whole entire life besides the other palette, you know? But these glitter shades, these three are my favorite in this one too. And then I love these three right here and then these three. You guys, I'm going to swatch the glitter ones for you, my two favorite glitter ones for you. Look at that. They are so, so beautiful. Can you see that? I can't even tell you guys how beautiful that eyeshadow palette is. I'm trying to get it off my hand. <laughs> Alright, next, this is the Naked 3 from Urban Decay. I only have the Naked 3. I don't have the Naked 1 or the Naked 2. But I have used my cousins. So, this one is definitely my favorite though. Rose gold eyeshadows are one of my favorite types to wear just look so pretty I loved these or like this side on, this side was more of what I used than this side I didn't really go over here much except for this one right here but oh my gosh you guys this palette is beautiful I want to go back to this and use more of these because I haven't used this eyeshadow palette I think yet this year maybe I have I don't really remember and then my last palette, oh my god, why do you guys like that? Okay, this is the Too Faced Naked Love palette. I also want to use more of this one because I've only used this one a few times and I've had it for like two months now. But these are the shades, they're so beautiful and it comes with so many. My favorites are these two. I also really like this one. I want to try the like this row. I want to use like more looks from this eyeshadow palette because it is really beautiful and I love so yeah those are all of my eyeshadow palettes like I said I can't find my Too Faced chocolate bar palette I don't even know where the hell it could be I have to clean out my room and check but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys <laughs>